in this video, we look at totaling and counting. Totaling and counting were introduced in our previous video titled Other Standard Methods of a Solution. In this video, we'll look at how these concepts can be implemented in various programming languages. We'll remind you of the Cambridge IGC pseudo code that you'll see in the exam at the end of this video. Totaling in various languages, here we're looking at Python, Visual Basic, C Sharp and Java, is almost identical. The only difference you can see here is that C Sharp and Java require a semicolon on the end. Counting is a little different in each language. Uh, we can see here there's multiple ways of doing it within a given language. So there's a way which we could argue reads better, but is slightly less efficient in terms of coding. So in Python, we've got number of students equals number of students plus one. And a very similar thing can be seen in Visual Basic, C Sharp and Java. However, we can perform the same thing, but by typing less. So in Python and Visual Basic, we can say number of students plus equals one. There are similar concepts that can be used in both C Sharp and Java shown on the screen. And here's a quick reminder of how these concepts could look in pseudocoded examples in the exam following the Cambridge IGC pseudocode. 